Hey everyone, in this tutorial I'll be teaching you how to create a rectangle by using Java and of course we'll be using GUI. Right now we have a blank window but we want to tell Java that we want to have a, a rectangle to appear inside of this window. I'll show you how to do it now. But first, we have to import a library. And that will be import java.awt.graphics. After we get done importing this library, we have to create a method which is public void paint. It's a must that you have this paint name on your uh, method right here. If you don't have paint as your name for this method then this method will be basically pointless. So make sure you have this name paint for this method or else it won't work. And also for the inside of the parentheses your argument will be graphics in a variable g. This right here is an object so make sure you have this inside your, arg your argument for this method. And this object came from this library right here. Alright so we got our variable g so we go we're going to be using that so I'll show you now. So right now we're going to make a rectangle so type in g dot draw rect all right for now or inside of this uh the parentheses we got to type in the location and right in the first we got to type the the horizontal location so uh that location will be 480 horizontally and now let's do the y axis uh position and that will be also 480. And then now you have to type in the width of the rectangle. And that width will be 200. And after that, we have to create a uh, height for the rectangle. And the height will be 100. And have semicolon after that. All right, so we're, we're now done making or drawing a rectangle for now for this con. And now, in order to uh, make that happen inside of this main method, you have to use the variable t from the object, and then draw or type in the the method paint. And inside the argument or inside the parentheses, make sure you type this as null, because we have nothing. Hold on, let me, I think this. Yeah, this has got to be lowercase. Yeah. Alright, well, the reason why we type in null for this is because that Java wants us to uh, type in something for this, the g variable. But we don't have anything to type in, so we type in as null. And the reason why we don't have anything to type in is because that we already set the, the variable g, uh, draw rect, and it, the location and the, the size of the rectangle. So all this is ready been inputted for this right here so that's why we typed in null all right so let's see what our triangle or not triangle our rectangle look like all right so we got an outline of the rectangle but what if we want something to be like filled in rectangle so I'll show you how to do it now so instead of uh, using draw rect we type in fill rect and we'll do the same thing like the location and all that as you can see there's an x-axis the y-axis width and height you see them typed right here alright for the position of on the x-axis let's do uh, 240 same thing over here 10 or not 1040 240 and same size too so this right here is be 200 yeah, it'll be 100 as well. 
Okay. So let's see what's happening. Alright, now we have two uh, rectangles. We got one filled in and one is that is an outline. But what if, what if we wanted to have a different color? I want to make this red and I want to make this blue. So let's make that happening. Let's, let's, yeah, let's make that happening as well. So we got to import another library for the colors. So import java.awt.color. And that's about it for this one. In order to use color, we got to type in the variable g as well and set color. And this color will, yeah, will be, uh, I forgot. I don't know which one's going to be blue and red, so, yeah, I'm going to just make this as, uh, yeah, red. Don't remember what it said, what color for which is which. So, yeah. Well, it doesn't really matter. Oh, yeah. Let me just do that. You can make this as any colors you want. It can be red, blue, silver, gray, etc. And for this, this is gonna be blue. Blue color dot or not dot color dot blue. All right, we got the different colors and yeah, we got everything. All right, well now we got a blue rectangle and a red outline rectangle. It's pretty neat, huh? We got we actually got something inside of this window, and that's pretty good. All right, well, this concludes my tutorial over making uh, a rectangle with Java. So, stay tuned for my next tutorial and thanks for watching.